<laughs> you sound so nervous. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I am nervous. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Okay. Good evening, everyone. My name is Kwaki Kumar, and I'm a second year student at Sports and Health Science College. Um, before I begin my presentation, I would like to thank Mr. Kimura, Mr. Yamamoto, and Mr. Ota for uh, setting up the session P5. Um, I would like to talk about the, my missing facts of being a college student. <laughs> so, uh, while I was thinking about what to talk during this presentation, it reminded me of the fears, the worries, and excitement that I felt before entering this university. And today I would like to talk about two of the worries that I had at the beginning of my college life. When I was, re when I was getting ready to begin my college life, there was one thing that came up to my mind that worried me. Just simply, I didn't know what to wear, because I was not used to choosing what to wear. Uh, university, because high school you have uniforms. Um, and everyone wears pretty fashionable clothes, but I prefer to wear just like this, like sweatpants <laughs> and t-shirts, because, you know, I, I like it. It's just my style. Um, and when I actually entered this university, I saw many of the sports and health science uh, students wearing uh, sweatpants and t-shirts. And I'm not only talking about the boys, but also the girls too. So it didn't seem so hideous of myself walking around campus wearing sweatpants and t-shirts. So that was all sorted. Secondly, from, a, from an academic point of view, I was afraid that my English skills would go down. I'm from Britomacon uh, OG High School, and there I used to be in cell course, which stands for Super English Language. And it is a class where you can learn subjects in English. So, I, uh, so every day I was speaking English in some sort of ways. And also, before I entered OG High School, I used to, uh, used to study in the UK for six years. So I was surrounded by a good environment to study uh, to, to study <coughs> the English language skills. After all these years of studying English and then thinking about myself entering this university, I thought I would lose my English. But now I'm now that I entered, I realized that I realized that the, this college, this college, uh, 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 this college uh, pays special attention to the English language skills. We have loads of homeworks, uh, including presentations and writings, and we even have internet homeworks and the opportunity to take TOE exams. Um, sorry. So, so I think I think the amount of homework and uh, homeworks that I get at this university is more than I used to get in high school. Also, another way that I found to keep my English is to make friends with foreign students. Um, this wasn't too hard for me because I like talking to them, and, and uh, I can actually go and talk to them without any, you know, hesitation or anything. Uh, I made five foreign friends here already: two American, two French, one German. Some of them has gone back to their country already, but I still. Make con uh, to, uh, I still keep in touch with them 
through Facebook. So these are the two, um, this is the, like, my favorite uh, quote that, yeah, it's my favorite quote. And these are the pictures. Um, so these are the two main worries that I had it, uh, I had for entering this college and how I felt afterwards. And of course there are more fears and worries and I'm really nervous right now. And, and but there are there is one thing that I realized uh, through throughout this experience is is that the key to change is to let go of fear. Yeah, just try out something new and you'll be fine. Like, I'm nearly done with this presentation and I'm feeling kind of okay now. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, um, I'm sorry that it, uh, my presentation didn't go well today, but yeah, that's it. Thank you for listening. Don't worry, you did a good job. No. <laughs> no. Okay, thank you so much.